From Birth to Death, The Life of Adolf Von Bayer. I need this baby out of me. Time to go to work. Push. Push. He's coming. Johann Frederick Wilhelm Adolf von Bayer was born on October 31st, 1835. Bayer is the son of Johann Jacob Bayer and Eugenie Nienhitzig. His parents were both academically advanced in literature and natural science. He had three sisters and a brother, Emma Rubick, Clara Bayer, Jeanette Bayer, and Edward von Bayer. Bayer was very bright from a young age. Ever since he was young, he loved chemistry and experiments, and even found a new double salt of copper. Bayer went to the University of Berlin, where he studied mathematics and physics. He did not find either of these as interesting as chemistry, so he decided to go work at Bunsen's laboratory. While working at Robert Bunsen's, a colleague and mentor in mentor's laboratory called Bunsen's Laboratory, Bayer's dedication and hard work towards his experiments led him to publishing his first work on methyl chlorides. After performing his experimental trials and months of hard work, he finally came to a conclusion of methyl chlorides. Woo! Woo! He then worked with Keekly, where he developed many new chemical theories. He knew chemical theories about five and six ring carbon structures. This included subjects such as strain theory. His chemical theories earned him recognition in the scientific world. After working there, Bayer returned to Berlin where he finally received his doctorate. In 1865, he began his work with indigo. Indigo dye is an organic compound with a distinctive blue color. The making of this dye involved a powder called fluorescent, but a plant is what gave it the blue color. He described his first synthesis of indigo in 1878 from isotan and second synthesis in 1880 from 2 nitro benzidylhyde. However, his synthesis of indigo still remained impractical, so alternative me methods to make it had to still be searched for. It was not until 1883 that Bayer finally determined the structure of indigo. The Nobel Prize in Chemistry 1905 was awarded to Otto von Bayer for his synthesis of indigo. Even though Otto von Bayer was very dedicated to his science experiments, he had a thriving personal life. He married Aldehyde Bendemann in 1868 and had five children, four sons and a daughter. His passion to science was passed on to his kids. All of his sons had prominent scientific careers. Tragically, on August 20th, 1917, Adolf von Bayer died of a seizure in his home. He was 82 years old when he died. Even though he died, he lives on through the uses of indigo, for example, in genes, and also his working uric acid used for sleeping drugs. The end!